Hi guys. Um, yeah, I'm unboxing a box today, a beauty box, um, but it's a new one for me. Um, I saw an advert on my Facebook for the Look Fantastic Beauty Boxes and um, I thought I'd give it a try. Um, I went, you can't have it just for one month, so I went for a three month subscription, which I think is 15 55 a month, something like that. Um, and the first box that I got was August, which is Look Fantastic Best of British. Now, I love the design. I'm sure Elemis did some packaging like this a, long, a little while ago, and it was lovely. Um, you also got, um, with this edition, a free issue of September issue of Elle magazine. It didn't come with the freebie, unfortunately, but um, I already had that, which was a little mini benefit to you, the hula. But um, yeah, I've got this anyway, so I'll be passing it on to a relative who I'm sure will enjoy it. Um, but yeah, that was okay. So this is my first box. And as I say, this is what it looks like. Union Jack design and the theme is Best of British. So I'm expecting all British brands, but we'll see. See if I can get it open first, which I can't. Gotcha. Best of British, believe in yourself and go for it, which is a quote by Emma Watson. Hermione. Can you see that? Probably not. But yay. Right, get a magazine. A little magazine, which tells you about what you've got, what's in your box. Um, so yeah, I have a black tissue and black fill. Right. Everything's dinky, so, you know, that's always an issue, but never mind. Right, first product that we come to is the Ren Flash Defense Anti-Pollution Mist. Um, yeah, what's this? That's what it is, and the size is a 9mm, so presumably this is a sample size. You can't see that at all, it's way too bright in here. Um, this mist is formulated with zinc and manganese amino acids to protect skin from oxidative stress caused by the harsh environments of cities. The formula shields your skin cells from pollutants to combat fatigue, breakouts and toxins to help your glow no matter where you are in the world. Well, I don't live in a city, so thankfully I, shouldn't I don't get too much pollution. Um, other than barbecues and bonfires at the minute. But um, yeah, sounds interesting. I haven't tried a lot of Ren. I really feel like I should try more Ren. Um, but yeah, so that's the first thing. Second, now this one, I think they dropped hints that this was in the box. Again, it's a sample size. Um, it is the Renew Skin Anti-Aging Lip and Eye Active Lift for Mature Skin. Do I have mature skin? Do I not have mature skin? Can you see that? No, probably not. <sighs> no matter what age you are, you should always invest in an eye and lip cream. The skin around your eyes and lips is thinner than any other part of the body, so it can be one of the first signs of aging. The Renault Lip and Eye Active Lift contains a blend of amino acids, wild yam, soya extract, and active marine magnesium, which help stimulate collagen and form the skin. The addition of arnica also helps to banish dark circles into the eyes and leaves you looking fresh, fresh, fresh faced. So, yeah, I um, don't really have a lot of issues with my eyes. I have more fine lines than actual darkness. Um, my mum has quite a bit of darkness around her eyes, so she might end up with this. But, yeah, give it a go anyway. And that size is 7 mil. Um, right, and it tells you a bit more about Renault products because, to be honest, I haven't heard of the brand before now. Right, this looks interesting. Um, it is the Bloom and Blossom Rejuvenate Rejuvenation Facial Spritz. And that is 40 ml, so that could be a hot full size, but I'm not sure. The total of 11 ingredients in this spray makes a gorgeous all-natural treat to use when your complexion needs a refreshing boost. With horsetail leaf and go-to cola leaf extract, it helps reduce fine lines, dark circles, and transform your skin from dull to fatigue to radiant and bright. Might as well give this a go. I presume you can use it over makeup. Ooh, that doesn't smell good. That's got a bit of order primary school toilet about it. Um, yeah, that doesn't smell amazing. I can see where, the, uh, where it is, like, it could be argued that it's herbal, but it's got ever such a slight thing of disinfectant to me. It feels nice, but, um, yeah, we'll see. Perfect keeping your handbag for an instant pick you up when you're in the move. The handy addition to your flight, hand luggage or beach bag. Spray it onto your face as required. It feels nice, I can't, I can't say it doesn't, but, 
Not sure about the smell, it's a little bit disinfectanty for me. But yeah, it feels nice. In fact, I'll do it again. Very nice. It does feel nice. I must admit, it is quite warm in here and it does feel quite nice. But it smells not great. Right, next up. Ooh, now this is interesting because if you watch QVC, and obviously I do, I'm a bit of a QVC addict, um, I, their current super size of the month is Persian Reed Wonder Balm. I'm actually using a Persian Weed product at the moment, which is the No Oil Oil, which sounds a bit strange, but that's really good. So I'm interested to see what this is. And this is a 30ml size. Uh, right, basically Miracle Balm, which preps and primes your hair in readiness for styling products and techniques, makes your regular styling products work better and gives you more, more control and a better result that lasts longer. But a towel dried hair working from roots to ends can also be worked sparingly into dry, dry styled hair to firm de definition. So I'll definitely give this a go. I do quite like the packaging. I love the illustrations on the Percy and Reed packets. So I'll give that a go. It's interesting because I've watched a couple of demos on QVC about this. So I'm quite keen to give that a go now. Balance Me. Now, Balance Me is a brand that appears a lot as a magazine freebie and it is a popular one for beauty boxes. And this is the Congested Skin Serum. Now, this sounds more like this is something that I can get on with. Uh, formulated with antibacterial mei chang, calming lavender and eucalyptus, this spot treatment works to banish blemishes naturally without the use of harsh chemicals. Skin is left feeling soothed and relieved without signs of irritation. It's non greasy and making it suitable for all skin types, including oily and sensitive. Now, I could actually have done them with this a couple of weeks ago. I had some nasty hormonal chin spots and they weren't nice. Um, so I could have done with this then, but yay, I, can get, I don't get as many spots as I used to, but I do get your odd hormonal breakout, so I will definitely be giving this a go. This sounds interesting. It's it's an interesting mix, I think. They've got a lot of things for anti-aging and then spots thrown in. Um, so I think they're trying to do a mix for everyone, but I'll definitely give that a go. And the final product is a lip balm. Um, if you've seen my recent my little box video, the beauty boxes all, at the moment are overloading you with lip balm, but this sounds nice actually. It's from Be Good, which I know are a British brand, and I know they're all for protecting bees and they're all cruelty free and everything. Um, again, I think they sell on QVC, so I've watched a couple of their demos. I've had a product before in a box which was a moisturiser, but it was way too rich for me, so my mum got it. Um, but um, yeah, so this sounds interesting. It's vanilla and honey. Vanilla and honey. Yes, we are going to focus. So let's see what it looks like. It's very thick. That's what it looks like. Mm. Tastes really nice. I don't actually like the taste or smell of honey, but that's very vanilla-y and I think it's just matted my lipstick down, which is nice. So yeah, um, what do I say about that? Compared to previous Look Fantastic boxes I've seen, that's disappointing, I've got to be honest. That's not wowing me. Um, all Skin K, which I think some people are going to love or you're going to hate. Um, I know people who love Skin K boxes, um, but I'm not sure about with them to be in all honesty because as in this one, it's a lot of things for different skin types. Um, obviously there's a hair product as well, but it's different skin types that it covers. And they're celebrating British brands, but I think there's a lot of more British brands out there that they could have included. But um, yeah, um, as I say, most of it will probably get used. Um, um, I'm not sure about the pollution, pollution mist. I'm going to have to do a bit more research on that and find out what that is. Um, because if it's just a toner, then obviously I can use it. But if not, I'm not really sure what it is. So I'll have to look that up. Um, spot treatment definitely use. I'll give the Wonder Balm a go. The lip balm will get used up because lip balms do. Um, and the Bloom and Blossom thing, as I say, it feels lovely, but I'm not keen on the smell. But we'll see. So I have to say, as I say, that hasn't wowed me. Considering the last box had Benefit, Cosmetics and things like that in it. Nothing appears to be a full size either, which is always a disappointment for a £15 box. That is one of the most expensive boxes that I'm trying. But as I say, I've got another couple of months of this, so hopefully I'll next time it'll be something that I'll like a bit more. So yeah, not wowed me that, I'm afraid. Um, the outer box was nice and the magazine was a nice freebie. So I'd love to know your thoughts. Let me know what you thought about this box. Are you like me? Do you think it should be more of a mix in a box or... Are you happy with lots of skincare? Let me know in the comments and obviously again I'd like to hear your box recommendations. Um, I will be getting around to applying to comments if I haven't already. Hopefully it'll let us actually reply to them 
Um, it hasn't been letting me reply to some of the comments and I don't know why. And it's been saying I've got comments on YouTube and I've gone into the comments to approve comments and I haven't. So I really don't know what's going on with my comments at the moment, but I'm going to try to sort that out. But thanks for watching anyway. Um, I'll list a full list of what's in this box below and the sizes and I'll link to the website so you can get your own and find out a bit more about it. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon with another video.